Hey guys, I'm Sean. And I'm Junior. And we're coming at you with our predictions for the hottest and the newest 20 wheels for 2020. Let's go. So for number 20, what we got for you guys is the Hostile Jigsaw. This one, as you guys know, was at SEMA 2017 as a forged wheel. Here it is as a cast wheel. It's basically been hanging in there for the last couple of years. You're gonna be seeing a lot of Hostile coming at you guys in the top 20. They've always been there. They're definitely hanging around. They're super sexy wheels. So kicking off at number 20, we have the Jigsaw for you guys. For number 19, we've got the Anthem Intimidator. It's gonna come in a gloss black and also this matte black finish. You're gonna see that Anthem tried something new here and actually did the logo right on the spoke. And then it's a very clean wagon wheel, off-road looking design that John knocked out from Team Anthem. So expect to see this one climbing up in 2020. Number 18 for you guys, we have the Havoc H109. This bad boy has been hanging in there like crazy. I think it's been three years in a row now that the Havoc H109 has been in there in the top I think it's just the massive lip that this thing's got, and it's got super aggressive angles, but it's still in there, number 18, Havoc H109. And I think now it has a silver logo. Thanks, John. <laughs> For number 17, we got the Archon Roosevelt. This is one of those wheels when it first came out with that deep, deep concave, but no lip. I was like, there ain't no way. And then it came out, and everybody, everybody, everybody's buying it. And I think it's because it's got the endless lip through the barrel. And then it's got this super aggressive spoke and then the milling seemed to be hot, hot, hot. Number 16 for you guys, just like the Roosevelt, we have the Fuel Assault for you. It's another concave wheel. This one is like the original concave truck wheel. You see it on a lot of vehicles, just giant, massive concavity. That's basically all there is to it. For number 15, we got the Vision Rocker. When this first came out at SEMA, I remember we were down there, saw it, said absolutely this is gonna be a hit. We were right once again, because that's what we do and it's gonna make the 2020 list once again. You can see it's a mesh spoke. They did the 12 wide, so 24, 12, one of the few companies that was doing that back then, and now it's becoming a really hot size, so I think it's gonna keep selling in 2020. Number 14 for you guys is the Extreme Motor XM306. Now this is a fairly new wheel. Extreme Motor as a company is also pretty new. Um, this wheel's got like a bajillion spokes, super curved styling, really thick milling. This isn't a true directional wheel though, so you're gonna have one side digging, one side swooping, but still super sexy wheel, definitely in the top 20 for us for uh, 2020. So for lucky number 13, we've got the Hostel Alpha. Junior called it way back in the day. He said this was gonna be a hot wheel when it came out at SEMA last year, year before, last year. Three years ago. Three years three. ago, life flies when you're having fun. But the Hostel Alpha is a super clean design. It's got that blocky spoke. It's the first of the hybrids that really took off with that deeper dish, the concavity to it, but still having a decent sized lip on it. So you're gonna continue to see the Alpha do super well in 2020. Number 12 for you guys is the Gear Big Block. For some reason, this one's still hanging in there. Uh, it's got the rivets around the rim. It's got nuts in the spokes. It's got a giant chunky center cap, but hey, you guys are loving it. So here it is. I bet you it's cause they like nuts in there. Next up, we got the Method NV. Just like we promised you guys, the off-road stuff's gonna start coming at you and you're already on top of it because this Method has just been growing, growing, growing in the last 12 months. And we believe that in 2020, she's gonna keep going. With new finishes such as this coming out in 2020, she's gonna be hot. Number 10 for you guys, halfway through our top 20 of 2020, we have the Hard Rock Crusher. This was super hot last year. It's gonna continue to be hot this year. Super sexy, simple styling. It's got a pretty big center cap, but other than that, I mean, it's a super clean, simple wheel. Not true directional, but still sexy. And in addition to all of that sexiness, they're also like super affordable. So you should definitely snag a set if you haven't already. Next up, we got the Fuel Maverick. This thing has been on here for 20, 25 years, I think. <laughs> um, it's just such a clean style. It's got the big lip. It's got some concavity to it way back in the day. Just a little bit, not a ton. And then of course they've got it in every size down to your UTVs, your trailers, your trucks, your boats. I don't, your hose. <laughs> <laughs> There's boats and hose. <laughs> your boat trailers, your UTVs. It's made in every offset, every finish. It's just a really solid wheel that's just not ever gonna go away in my opinion. Number eight for you guys is the Moto Metal 962. Your brothers, mothers, fathers, sons, and daughters all still have these from last year to this year. It's creeping down on the list though, but still hanging in there at number eight. Next up, we've got lucky number seven. It's gonna be your TIS 544. This is in the black and mill. And of course we have the exclusive red and mill, which is super hot still. 
This is just a very active luxury design. They use a lot of milling to make the spokes look really thin. It's got that very forged look, completely flat spoke, big lip, and then of course the TIS off-road, which they're gonna actually carry through almost all, all of their 2020 designs for the TIS lineup. This is another one that they're coming out with dualies, a whole bunch more sizes and offsets. They're definitely gonna uh, make sure that you can put this on your trailer, anything you wanna use it for, because the TIS 544 has been so popular. Number six for you guys is the Ultra Hunter. This came out in our top like five last year, pretty hot, popular size. The 20 by 10 had like a six inch lip. They're bringing out new sizes for this year. This one's a 24 by 12 with a seven inch lip on it. So cool to see that they're taking that like wheel that they had, growing their market with and kind of opening up to different sizes. And they're also super, super affordable at the same time. Number five, we've got Hostile again in the top five. I think they've been in our top five every single year. I was super popular. And we got the Hostile Sprocket. When it came out, everybody knew it was gonna be a hit. It's very forged looking. Again, with the flat face. Again, with the narrow spokes created by the milling. The Sprocket is gonna stay here for years to come. It's not going anywhere. Sick wheel. Number four for you guys, we have the Moto 970. This bad boy has been out for a while. Super hot style. It's been like hanging in there. Uh, a lot of sizes, a lot of finishes. Super clean, simple style drill. You can put on basically anything from a stock truck all the way up to a giant lifted one. That's why it's number four. Number three, I've got the TIS 547, which is gonna keep that TIS off-road around the lip of the wheel, just like their super successful 544. But it's gonna go with another flat spoke, which tapers down, um, looks very similar to a forged wheel that was super hot back in the day, but they're about $10,000 a set. But there's gonna be a cast version, which is gonna stay right in that price range, but give you that forged look. It is not true directional. So it'll be interesting to see it compete with the Caesar, which is a similar style concept wheel in 2020. Number two for you guys is the Archon Lincoln. You know it, you love it. It's a hybrid wheel and Sean designed it. Clean rim, clean center cap, exposed lug nuts, you can spike lug nuts, basically everything you want or need and it's proper directional. So Sean definitely knew what he was doing with this wheel, designed it super sexy, looks hot, chrome, black and mills. Say more about up. me designing it. Sean designed it. Did I mention it? Sean designed it. Archon Lincoln, designer. Ding, 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 the Lincoln. Ding, 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 the Lincoln. Ding, 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 the Lincoln. Ding, 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 the Lincoln. Sean, Chartier. Number two, Sean. I designed this wheel. Number one is gonna be the newly released Archon Caesar, already taking off like crazy. And it's because it's got that slight concavity, the hybrid, which everybody likes. It's also got the illusion of a super flat spoke. Use some milling to shrink down those spokes and then it's gonna be proper directional. That's the big, big. Because this is giving you that very forged wheel look and feel. And I think that's why this is gonna be unstoppable in 2020. Another one designed by ours truly, John. Shirt here, absolutely killed this wheel. We don't think it'll be stoppable. We predicted it for the Lincoln in 2019. We're predicting it again for the Caesar in 2020. Already working on some new sizes for this one. Chrome is gonna look hot. It does look hot. Caesar won't be beat in 2020. That's our prediction and that's a wrap. And you're gonna wanna get the replacement plan also, which Archon offers.